I cut off 15 inches of my hair in Korea and I'm gonna show you exactly what happened at the salon but first let's go back to the start of this journey. I've had really long hair and I mean really long hair for most of my life. It would get caught in car seat belts, people would sit on it by accident, it touched the ground whenever I tied my shoes. Like I said, it was very very long and it was also my most identifiable feature, arguably my best. When I posted my long hair care routine on YouTube, over 3 million people watched it. And now don't get me wrong, I love my hair just as much as you guys, it's been my safety blanket and a huge part of my identity for years but i was bored honestly it was almost always tied up or behind my back or i was just always pushing it out of my face because it was too long for me to know how to style it so without consulting friends family or the internet i decided to cut off most of it so without further ado let's get into the video so this morning and i lonnie are actually up early it's like what eight eight o'clock Seven thirty. Yeah. we woke up at six in the morning and we're gonna go get egg drop which is like an egg sandwich place but anyways we're gonna go get breakfast and then we're gonna have a whole beauty day in hongdae again So our first stop was Juno Hair and we just called in appointments beforehand and I got the hairdresser Do Hoon. He was super, super nice. And there was a bit of a language barrier, but we communicated through Google Translate, so it wasn't too bad. But I had a consultation before sitting down and I just showed him these photos. We decided to go forward with a kind of digital and C-curl perm while cutting off like half of my hair because I told him I want it to fall above my chest, which it hasn't been that short in years, but I told him it was fine. He was really worried, but I was like, it's fine, like cut it off, it's okay. So he started cutting the length and also thinning it out and giving me layers so the curls look nicer. And then we moved on to a keratin treatment because he said the perm does damage your hair and he just wants to strengthen it. And then we washed out the treatment and then moved on to putting in solution to make my hair elasticy. I don't have this on camera, but we could literally stretch my hair like a rubber band after we were done. Even though Dahoon and I basically couldn't speak to each other except through Google Translate, I actually understood all the steps because he was explaining it every time. All the steps? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, yes, I understand. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think. And then Lonnie was getting a cute little long wolf cut. And this is just like the secondary hairdresser that I had. She was just checking on the elasticity of my hair to make sure we can move forward with like the perm solution, I believe, because the bonds in your hair basically need to be broken so they can be reformed in the shape of a curl. So like that's how you get a perm. And I have like untouched virgin hair. So she actually needs to put this on for a little bit longer than it should have taken, they said. And then I changed chairs and sat under this contraption. It literally looks so scary. And I was just thinking the whole time, if there's a fire, how would I leave the building? Like I wouldn't, like I would just have to take it. I would just have to sit in this chair with my hair attached to this machine, like in 30 different ways. And then he basically just sectioned my hair and put it in the rollers, mostly focusing it on the ends because I did want it to be a bit straighter. After letting this sit for like an hour, they took it all out and I was so nervous. I literally looked like the founding fathers. Like, why is my hair so curled? But then we like took it out and then we washed it out. But honestly, you just gotta trust the process. It's really curling. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> After we took out all the rollers, Dohuna actually took a straightener to straighten like the first half of my hair because referencing the photo, it's like a straight perm and then it's permed, like curly perm at the bottom. So it's a little bit odd. Like I know American perms are usually like your entire head and you kind of look like a poodle for the first two days, but that's not what I wanted. So that's why he's kind of undoing that right now. I'm so nervous. And then Dohun just gave me a finishing cut, styled it, and showed it to me. And honestly, it was really, really nice. It felt so light and so different. I'm honestly very, very happy with it. And this is the first step of our little glow up in this video because I feel like I've had the same hair for literally like 10 years or like even longer than that. And it was just time for a change. I know when I posted the before and after results on my Instagram, a lot of you guys didn't like it. I think the response was actually like 50-50 between people loving it or hating it. And I just want to say that I really like the way it 
it came out. I do get it retouched a little bit the next day, but I'm very happy with the results. And I know you guys really liked my long hair. A lot of you followed me because I had long hair and I don't know what else to say, but it's been cut. I can't undo it. This is like two month old footage. Hope the new hair era grows on you because it literally will grow on you. <laughs> yeah, again, I'm really happy with it. And I think Dohan did a really good job. Okay, guys, and this is the fucking look. Oh my god. I like it. It's a lot shorter. Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to day four in Korea. Today we're actually going back to Hongdae because I have another hair appointment. We also have a few animal cafes that we want to go to, a sheep and a cat one. And then we also have a nail appointment later in the night. So without further ado, let's get into it. I'm actually gonna go get my hair fixed today. It's just way too hot, you guys. And I had like a mental breakdown yesterday. <laughs> Cafe. This is the first animal cafe Lonnie's ever been to, so we're gonna make it a good one. It's called Thanks Nature Cafe, and you can literally see the sheep from like outside. The only times I ever pet any farm animals was at a literal farm. Lonnie, have anything to say? Excited? I'm so excited! <laughs> we literally made a Korea bucket list, and this was at the top of the list. Oh, look, Korea! <laughs> they look so soft. So this is what Lonnie and I look like for reference at movie film and we're gonna show you guys what the photo booth makes us look no, like. like. it's so bad. Not only do they yassify us, but they like <laughs> make us so pale. Damn. Like you can look at our stomach. Look at my stomach here. That is insane. And then look at our faces. Like the auto detect like doesn't do our whole body. It's like look at my skin tone versus me in the photo. Next on the glow up to-do list is nails. So I just have this design here and she's cutting my cuticles. These are my naked nails. She did such an amazing job. I feel like they don't look real. And the design I chose is one that I found on Instagram and they did such an amazing job. The nail artist is literally using like four different bottles of pink just to get the exact look. She has such a steady hand and also just got all the details, like even down to like the glitter placement. Like I'll show you guys in the results. It's actually insane. I loved my nails. These are probably the best nails I've ever gotten. And then for Lonnie and I's own mental wellness, we decided to have an early night in. We just drank a little bit of soju and played We're Not Really Strangers. We actually finished up the game this day and I thought it was really fun and the perfect remedy to the overstimulation from the day.
Hi guys, welcome to day five in Korea. I'm not wearing any makeup today because Lani and I are actually going to Gangnam to get facials. And then after that, we're gonna head over to Songsu and do some more cafe hopping there. I really wanna take Lani to Super Matcha, which was in my last vlog. So let's get into it. These are my nails from yesterday. Really show like a proper reveal, but they came out so cute. I love the pink melody. <laughs> oh my God, it's getting blurred out. Our matching thumbs. Okay, so Lonnie and I made it to Gangnam, except I didn't do my research, so all the beauty clinics are closed today, so we're not getting facials, and, but we're just gonna cafe hop for now and we'll probably do some shopping before heading over to Songsu. Right now we're at Upper and Under. So I just got a matcha latte, and as usual, Lonnie got a coffee. Every matcha girl needs a coffee best friend. First matcha of the day. How is it? Straight up milk. Really? Yeah. I've been taking these everywhere with me. Last time I finished a bottle here, actually. So after our first plan for the day basically fell through, Lonnie and I decided to kind of have a no social media, no schedule day because we were both mostly dressed down and the last week had been super hectic and on the go. So, so we just took this time to really chill and basically just a really nice like mental wellness day in general. Oh, it's gonna be. I can't read that word. Cab Camberme. Ka. Cow. No, Camberme. You're thinking of Cabernet, which is a type of wine. Oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> what did you do to it? <laughs> Looks like a pair of pants. You said you're not supposed to eat this part. Mine looks like a tooth. <laughs> <laughs> no, mine looks more like a tooth. <laughs> Good night. The fact that it's a cheese pop up caught me so off guard. The guy in the first one, my favorite cheese, he's like, Do you know this cheese? <laughs> I was like, I don't know no. cheese. He's like, It's French. <laughs> also, this is the view. The sky is so clear. It's so I don't even think this cheese is doing well with my stomach. You're not even lactose intolerant. I know. I'm the one who's lactose intolerant <laughs> and we're the cheese tasting. Cheese anywhere pop up. Like, okay, vibes. Oh, it's in Korean. Why are we shocked? Ew. <laughs> Sorry. We read this. We've been educated. And they also gave me a free knife. Look. And it was free. Oh, it's from 